So this is one of the outcomes I got before making this video and I think it looks quite smart and good. So if you want to learn how to do it, please follow the steps. First thing you have to do is to choose a color for your background. It should be similar to the color your object is going to be drawn in. I chose blue and my object is going to be blue. So draw a circle shape. Uh, click on control and hold it to make a perfect shape, which will help you. Yeah. Now let's go on blending options, gradient overlay. Yeah, and um, choose a color to be similar to your background color. But it makes sense, why? Now we will do stroke, a stroke has to be quite big, I done a size 10 and uh, choose quite dark color. Now let's duplicate the object. Inner shadow is quite important as well. You will see what it does as I increase the size. Yeah. It's like outer glow, but it happens inside the object. Now we are going to do the outer glow. This outer glow is going to stay inside the object, it's not getting away from it. So don't make it too big. As you can see it stays inside now let's go back to the old object and uh, yeah do the outer glow again this will go actually away from the object so you can make it as big as you want it to be Now I'm going to put text on the front of it to create an idea for you people. You see how it looks with the text on top. I didn't make many changes to the text actually. I didn't make it really nice so I just made it as an example. You don't need to do the same. So yeah, I think it looks quite good. If you liked it, just yeah, keep it and use it as your logo button. And that's it, we are done. So if you like the video, please like it below and um, share with your friends who are interested in Photoshop and wait for more, more lessons.